I've never seen pink shrimp. Hi, Bobby Dolls. I'm Mrs. Bobby. Bobby Love and West Hollywood. Thanks so much for my video. Today, I'm doing quarantine pink food cooking. Yay. Just made something and it looks so good. I cannot wait to eat. Ta da! I made pink shrimp fried rice. It looks so good and smells so good too. Yeah. So, first of all, please watch how I made this today. And I'm gonna taste it. So, let's start. First of all, you need to prepare rice. This time, I cooked brown rice. It's really yummy. So, please make sure to have your rice ready. You can, of course, use white rice. So, let's start. I'm super hungry. So, first of all, let me start with this. Fresh shrimp, raw shrimp. I could use frozen one, but I was kind of craving for like something fresh. So I'm gonna use this raw shrimp today. And of course, I'm trying to make it pinker. You know what? I don't know if we could dye shrimp into pink with beet powder. But you know me, I'm like a mad scientist. So I wanna try this with beet powder. Just to resolve, put a little bit hot water. Looks a little bit crazy, I know. Yeah, let me <laughs> let me try. Wait, huh? I don't know how it's gonna be, but okay. Let's put it here. Just five is enough. <laughs> Looks pretty crazy. Well, but you know, I'm not sure if the color will stay or not. You know, I want to put a little salt, potato starch. Yeah, I really feel like I'm more like scientist more than chef, you know. And now I want to rinse. I'm gonna rinse once, make the smell less fishy. And we need paper towel. Put pink shrimp. And absorb excess liquid. And now we need one egg white. Just egg white, put some oil, potato starch again. Oops, <laughs> this one is already mixed. Salt and pepper, and a little bit of okay. it. Just a little this time. There's already kind of pink, so I just put a little bit. <laughs> I was gonna put before beating, but okay, now I can put it back. Like I said, it will make the shrimp taste less fishy. Okay, leave it a little bit. And I'm gonna use this later. And now I wanna put this. For quarantine cookie, my, my Japanese friend sent it to me. The freeze dried green onion. Isn't that cool? I was gonna soak in the water or hot water, but actually these are already tiny, so I can totally put these into the pan when I'm cooking. Yeah, I'm gonna just use this. Later. These are freeze-dried green onion, so they last long. The expiration date is really long, so it's perfect for quarantine cooking. Take my rice. Don't you love my rice cooker? So I DIY'd my rice cooker. From regular boring design to Barbie rice cooker. <laughs> if you never watched my rice cooker DIY, please watch. I have a playlist for DIY videos and you can totally watch from there. And when you mix rice, please be careful, like don't mash them. I'm mixing but I'm not mashing them, you know. You don't want to break rice. Okay, but my rice is ready. Using bigger pan today. Turn on the heat. Put some oil. I'm putting this shrimp. I've never seen pink shrimp. I have no idea how the shrimp color is gonna turn out. Ah, I cooked too much. But the so far color looks pretty. 
You know what? It's so hard to tell if it's cooked or not because it's pink. <laughs> but I think I'm okay because I've been cooking pretty long, you know. Yeah, I think it's good. Now let's put rice. And green onion. And the powdered soup stock, the Japanese soup stock. A little soy sauce. And tiny, tiny bit of sesame oil. Just a little bit. And sesame seed. I put a lot. Oh my gosh, smells so good. It smells really, really good. You know what? I need more rice. Not enough rice. Can I make it pinker now? Is it too late? I think it looks good. I mean, it looks pretty yummy. It smells so good. Okay, let's eat it. I think it's, now it's cooked. Again, let me show you. Ta-da! Doesn't it look good. It looks so good. If you're allergic for shrimp, if you don't like shrimp, maybe you could use chicken or either like some veggie instead, you know. But I wanted to do with shrimp today. Se no, itadakimas. Let me try with shrimp first. Yeah. It kind of turned into orange because that's the color of cooked shrimp. But it still looks pink. Yeah, and the shrimp totally looks like it absorbed some bit water. Mmm! So good! The texture is seriously crazy. It's so good. It's so flavorful. Yeah, so I'm so glad that I prepared for shrimp today. So it doesn't have any any weird fishy smell. Mmm! Gohan! Oishi! The rice part is even crazier. It tastes so good. Delicious. When I eat rice, either white rice or brown rice, I always put some sesame seeds. It makes the taste and texture better, more flavorful, and also it will add more nutrition, like a good nutrition. Yummy! You could totally start with like thawed frozen shrimps, but of course it tastes way better if you use wild shrimps. I am so satisfied with my lunch today. It was so good. You need to try this because this is so good. Thanks so much for my video. Stay home, be safe, be happy. Hope you have pink stuff Barbie crown team. Bye.